Hi! So, I think it's important to talk about this subject. I know a lot of people don't talk about this, but one thing that I would tell you is that when it comes to the NCLEX exam, you know, there's different factors that really play a role in your ability to pass. And unfortunately, people, a lot of um, prep courses or reviews or teachers, however it may be, they have more of a narrow perspective on what they will share with you as far as passing. You know, all they focus on is the content and, and doing questions and strategies and that's it. But what about outside factors, you know, that also play a role in your ability to pass your exam? And one thing I have found, you know, from talking one-on-one -on -one with hundreds of nurse graduates who have not been able, not been able to pass their exam is I don't recommend, and this is, and hear me, it depends on, everybody has their own opinion, but this is what I found as far as the best. I personally do not recommend that you um, get a RN job prior to getting licensed. Now, obviously we all have to work, right? We need to make a living, we need to pay our rent, bills, all that kind of stuff. But however though, I'm referring though, where you have that type of um, situation where you start working an RN job and now they're waiting for you to pass your exam, right? And then once you pass, you know, you're good. But here's the thing that I have found. I don't recommend doing this. I think it's better that you first pass your exam and then you look for an RN job. Because here's why, it's stressful. It's, it's more stressful, you, that's more stress. The exam itself is stressful, but now you have the pressure where you have a job that's telling you, you know what, you have to pass by this amount of time. Otherwise, you know, you'll lose this job, you'll lose this opportunity. You know, it's to me, it puts more pressure and it, it decreases your likelihood of passing because you're stressed out for other reasons aside from the test. And I don't know about you, but when I'm stressed, it's hard for me to focus. So I think it's better to tackle one thing at a time. And I have noticed that a lot of the people who have been successful weren't working. Um, now granted though, there are definitely plenty of people who, who got a job, got a preceptorship position, or got an RM position, and then th did pass their exam, definitely. But however though, I don't personally recommend it. If you have a choice, I would recommend that you first get licensed, then after you get licensed, then begin to pursue a job, you know? And and then, and you know, the thing about nursing, there's so many jobs, there really is. Now what you can definitely do is that while you're looking for, while you're studying for your exam, you can definitely, you know, scan around and see online your potential jobs. But I personally would recommend that you wait till you get licensed before you start working a new RN job, right? Because it, it can be stressful and you want to minimize and reduce your stress level. So hopefully this is helpful. Hopefully you found this information insightful. And one thing I would encourage you to, if you have never been on my free webinar training, then I encourage you, join me. You know, you can join right now. It's, ca it's called How to Pass Your NCLEX Exam in 30 Days. So if you're in a position where you need to pass sooner than later, then you can sign up for the webinar training through free webinar, uh, sorry, freetraining.choosingnursing.net. So I'm excited and hopefully I will see you there. Thank you again for watching and I'll see you the next time. All right, bye-bye.